Well, another sticking point regarding the deployment of THAAD, whether Seoul and Washington will be sharing information obtained from the radar with Tokyo. Arirang News National Defense Correspondent Kim Hyun-bin reports. Seoul and Washington say they will not share with Tokyo the information obtained from the THAAD missile defense system to be stationed in South Korea. The remarks come amid speculation that the system will eventually become part of the larger missile defense system operated by the U.S. and Japan. A South Korean government official said Monday that under a trilateral agreement with the U.S. and Japan, South Korea is obligated to share information on North Korea's nuclear and missile tests with Japan, but that the information from the THAAD radar won't go to Tokyo. Another official pointed out that it won't be effective to share information on an incoming missile in its terminal phase. The THAAD battery is scheduled to be deployed to Songju County before the end of 2017, and it will be operated independently by the U.S. forces in South Korea. The deployment has raised concerns among Songju residents about the electromagnetic waves emitted by the THAAD radar. The Defense Ministry on Monday reiterated the system poses no health risks. The THAAD radar will be on high ground and far away from the closest village. The radar beam will be emitted at a five-degree angle or higher, so it will do no harm to humans or the environment. The spokesperson emphasized that the electromagnetic waves emitted by the THAAD are higher than that of the Patriot system, but lower than the Green Pine radar system, both of which are currently in operation in South Korea. The military showed the Patriot and Green Pine system to reporters earlier this month taking several electromagnetic wave readings from 30 to 100 meters away. The readings were a tab higher than normal, but the military assured the public the system poses no health risk. Kim Abin, Arirang News.